The Armed Forces of the Philippines reported that AFP Chief of Staff General Andres Centino visited the Philippine Army Armor Division in Camo O'Donnell in Capas, Tarlac and inspected the ASCOD-2 Sabre Tank and Pander-2 Tank. So far the photos posted by the AFP did not show any actual Pander-2 vehicle although one of the infographics shows a Pander-2 8x8 with a tank turret. So were there deliveries of Pander 2 Sabre wheeled tanks lately? Sources said none although further verification is needed. The PA is poised to receive 18 ASCOD-2 Sabre tanks, an ASCOD-2 command vehicle and an ASCOD-2 Arnord recovery vehicle, 10 Pander 2 Sabre tanks, and, potentially, two more Pander 2 vehicles to provide a starting point for the Philippine Army's goal of re-establishing its lost armored tank capabilities. The Mechanized Infantry Division MID, has proposed the acquisition of light or medium tanks to enable them to relearn the operation and use of tanks in different combat situations. The Philippine Army's light tank acquisition project was born after a long study and debate within the organization on whether to go for heavy main battle tanks whose combat weight is between 55 to 70 tons, or light and or medium tanks whose combat weight would be less than 42 tons. While plans to acquire main battle tanks remain, the MID would like to learn first from operating modern light medium tanks to determine if they're suitable enough to meet their current and future requirements.